morning everyone. This is Teacher Maricor. How are you today kids? Hope you are doing well. Last week, you have learned about the concepts and principles of photography. Today, we will be discussing about the parts and functions of the camera. Point and shoot camera or phone camera. Children, you know already what to do in capturing a good scene. Who among you fell in love with photography? While staying at home, you can make a compilation of your own pictures, of your family, and relatives, and other photos, which reminds you of something relevant to your life as a learner in the new normal education. Last, always remember that understanding the elements and principles of art will make you capture a good scene around you. You know, photography is not just about taking photos. It is also about applying or using the elements and principles of art. So let us be very careful in capturing a scene. In photography, a camera is an important tool. Yes, these captures are very moment, and that moment will not be the same again as of that time. So take chances of taking a photo. One thing more children, camera choice depends on what the camera can do and the abilities and skills of the photographer. Thanks to the growth of technology, taking pictures have become easy and handy. Mobile phones now are equipped with a camera. Last, point and shoot camera, also known as compact camera, is a still camera designed primarily for a simple operation. You need to know the different parts of a camera and their functions. It is important in taking pictures. The parts vary from one camera to another. What are the different parts of a camera, their functions? So here are the parts of a camera. Power button, flash, lens, memory card slot, monitor screen, battery chamber, and shutter button. Power button is used to turn the camera on and off. You just press it. Flash allows the taking of pictures in low light conditions. Lens is used to focus the image scene at close or far ranges. The next one, memory card slot, houses the removable storage card. The fifth one is monitor screen frames the image for your picture. Next is a battery chamber. It's a slot where the battery is placed. And the last one is shutter button. It's pressed to capture a picture. So you know now the different parts of a camera and their functions. Is photography important? Yes, many people fell in love with photography. They may not be professional photographers, enjoy taking pictures of their family, friends, vacations, events, and celebration. We we'll learn about people from different parts of the world. Pictures show a scene of important and historic events, and you learn events in the past using pictures. Now children, let us check your ability if you learned the lesson. Match the description in column A with a part of camera in column B. Write the letter only on the blank provider.
class, let us now answer the activity. Number one, the button is pressed to take picture. What is your answer? The answer is letter E, shutter button. Very good children. Number two, this focuses the image seen at close or far ranges. What is the correct answer? The answer is letter D, lens. Number three, this allows photography in low light conditions. The answer is letter B, flash. Number four, this is where you frame the image you want to capture. What is it? The answer is letter A, monitor screen. Good children. And number five, it is used to turn the camera on and off. What will be your answer? The answer is letter F, power button. Good job, kids. That's all for today. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed the lesson. Happy to serve!